Juventus have been in excellent form. They are unbeaten in 16 in all competitions. It is the biggest stage here, the Champions League. And tonight, Zurich making their debut in the group stages. Coach Inke Grings played at the very highest level, a seven-time German Bundesliga winner, a two-time European Championship winner. Well, tonight she'll need her team to play at the very highest level. Go instead goes for the cross and totally unmarked over the bar. What a chance. The flag stayed down. Had to be incredibly versatile, playing it right back for a long time and even at one point being the backup goalkeeper because things got so bad. As Damjanovic is brought down and that will be the first yellow card of this game. The ball through the lines. It's a nice one as well. And the strike almost in. What a brilliant save from Tegan Micah to deny Lena McGull. Certainly goal bound. Lovely whipped effort on the left foot. Tegan Micah had to be at her best to keep it goalless. Manly Simon's corner. And the header down and almost sneaks in off the post. A really awkward one for Tegan Micah. Fana Damjanovic almost on target there. Last scored. Kulashi. Good feet from Morietta Kulashi, who wins the set piece. That's exactly what you want from. Put in in swinging by Bria God. Towards that back post. It's still in there and it's dribbled in. Rosa God has the lead. Lorietta Kulashi with the goal. Really good corner in a dangerous one from Sofia Briadgod. Just couldn't quite get it away. And it was Kulashi's header. Maria Gross got a hand on it, but not a convincing enough hand to keep it out. It dribbles in. Well, you would have got relatively few predicted. Referee Svetkovic had to get out of the way there. Lohman cross field. And it dribbles just wide. Wonderful vision from Sidney Lohman to create the chance. Right wing back position. Just diverts it the other side of the post. It was Raul, you might remember, who had that good chance earlier on in the game from the free kick. Not an easy technical skill to execute there. Relatively simple one, and I'm being completely sarcastic there. Barcelona at home. Rosengard, get the ball in from the left. And Vick. Dahlman. Now the floated cross comes in. It's a really good one, and it's gone all the way in. Bayern Munich have an equaliser. Within 10 minutes of going behind, the German Giants find a response. Not sure anybody got a touch on it on the way through. Caroline Simon's cross, and I'd expect it will go down as her goal. And Dahlman, Stanway. Trying to pick the log. Now McGull's cross. It's too close to Tegan Micah. Set piece chance for Bayern. Simon to take it and floats it over the bar. And Damjanovic, a two time Bundesliga winner with Bayern and with Wolfsburg as well. Serial goal scorer at that level. It's been a bit of a surprise this year. Only get one in seven across all competitions so far. Down goes Mimi Larson. Foul from Stanway. Will go in the book for that one, Georgia Stanway. Dangerous from dead ball deliveries. Sophia Briotgaard is going to leave this one though. It's dinked up, only half cleared. Back towards goal. 
Simon prevents the corner. Now another chance for Skog. Good feet from Skog. Half decent cross as well. It might drop and it's smashed over by Mia Pershall. Really good persistence to win it back. Very good from Clara Boo. Now Stanway. It's Bull trying to keep it alive and has done magnificently. Great save, but in on the rebound by Munich Leeds. A simple tap in for Lena Dahlman. Hard work was done really by Clara Bull here, the substitute. Superb to keep that one in play. And then Damjanovic initially saw her head is saved by Tegan Micah, but was celebrating moments later as it dropped for Linda Dahlman to score. Corner dinked in. Headed away, miscued volley. And recycled. McGall's deflected ball, and that's a really good save from Tegan Micah. The deflection completely changed where that one was going. I think it was sneaking just in as well. Clever reverse ball from Dahlman. Just takes a, a little nick on the way through. Mission guard have really threatened from dead balls this season, and it is Pearson to clip it in. It's a really awkward one, and Gross gets an important hand on it. Back towards goal and off the bar. All sorts of pressure on Bayern Munich. Cross initially in there. Recycled cleverly from Arnaud Dottier. It's Pershon's left-footed strike. Dalma. Cross harmlessly sails into the hands of Tegan Micah. Another Swedish side. So that will be a foul as well. You can hear what the home fans think of it, and you can see what Lena McGull thinks of it. With his figure stopped here once off Rosengord, of course. McGull on the turn, really clever. Got blocked initially, but the pressure very much remains. Now, Emily Laurent, who offers quite a flat threat in her own right. Great cross from Laurent. It will run for McGull. Still McGull. Caught well by Micah. The two-legged tie that they won to get here. Love the attack from Bayern. We were looking to find Laurent. It might still work out. Laurent in there fighting for it. But Micah will gather. It comes from Caroline Simon. Looping head up. It's harmless for Rosengord. You get to get on with it. And that will be that here at FC Bayern campus. It is a winning start to Bayern Munich's Champions League campaign. But they had to do it the hard way. They had to come from behind.